Okay, welcome back to my Let's Play, my free upcoming Serious Sam game. Serious Sam Revealed. It's free to empowered. We're playing level 5 now, which I hope isn't as hard as some of the levels before, like level 3, and more like the difficulty of level 4, which was easier than 3. 4 is much easier than 3, apparently. But this is level 5. This could be kind of difficult. I don't know how difficult this map is. So far, we haven't really seen too many strong enemies in Sarah Sam Revealed. Things like Mechanoid Majors, things like that. We do have a rocket launcher, finally, which will help us a lot. Here's our first... Sorry, not our first arachnoid. That's not our first arachnoid, but first of this level, anyway. Not a arachnoid here. Guarding a switch. Now, we're, we're, we're running really low on ammo, but I'm going to use the Uzis for a while. And they don't have a lot of ammo, but... I wasted a lot of bullet ammo on showing off that assault rifle in the last level, which is not that good of a gun, actually. I'd rather use the Uzis. Uzis are very good for killing hordes. They're much better at doing that than the assault rifle is. Now we got this area here. This is the first area you're going to be really careful in this. So I'm going to use rockets, because there's a biomechanoid major here. There he is. He's dead. Good. There's another one there, too, that's dead as well. And this ray gun could be really useful, so let's use it. Now it's getting to the point where it's going to get a little bit more difficult, and using it might not be such a bad idea. We're not supposed to have it yet. We got it in the secret in the last level, which I found by pure accident. But I knew exactly where to find that secret, because I'm used to playing modified randomly generated maps. So the secrets sometimes are in very obvious places for me. Okay, so we go here. Yeah, I remember this map. This one's actually kind of difficult. I wouldn't say it's nuts difficulty, but it's, it's still pretty difficult for a level. Yeah. I remember this level. When I played it by default, when we first tested this thing, I had a hard time with this level, and there is a ray gun in it, but you have to fight a lot of tough enemies to reach it. So finding that ray gun in level 4, the secret one, is kind of important. And finally we get a Reptiloid. Reptiloids are kind of rare in this, but they do appear a lot more later on. Finally, some shotgun ammo. Nice. Now, this guy here we just killed. It seemed like it was a uh, beheaded rocketeer, but it's not. It's a beheaded rocket cracker. They are a nasty new enemy that's in this. They are rocket shooting beheaded guys. They fire spreads of rockets at you. And the rockets are rockets that are just like the ones fired from your rocket launcher. So they do a lot of damage. But the good news is they're fairly rare. You won't run into them very often. And we have a huge horde of wearables here. So ray gun's the best weapon to use here, I think. Oops, Biomechanoid Major again. Grab the armor here. Well, we don't actually need to grab it, so whatever. And he obviously came from somewhere around here, so...
Okay, so we have to go here. This gun's very useful. Although you definitely want to save it up for later. I don't recommend wasting it too much early on. Because later on it becomes extremely useful in big fights. And here's another flame walker, but this one was much easier to kill than the one that killed us in level 3. And we have enormous horde of wearables here again. Probably one killed a reptiloid due to infighting. And here's the ray gun. That I found hard to get when I played this the first time. I didn't have the hidden one from level 4. And here's the red key I missed in this level once as well. Don't forget that's there, just saying. There's a secret that's obvious, with a boost of speed in it. I call them that now. I know it's technically serious speed, but still. I actually probably like serious speed. It's a good power-up in this. There's a lot of hidden serious speeds in this game, too. Serious damages are much harder to get than serious speeds in this thing for some weird reason. There are a few, but they're kind of rare. So you definitely don't want to waste them. Where is that red key door? Crap. There it is. Uh, lucky there. I almost lost. A couple of rocket crackers in this area too. I guess they're not as rare as I thought they were. Well, they didn't show up to level 5, which is good. That means this thing is more balanced than I thought in this run. Although it is kind of random, so you never know when they're going to show up. And there's a mega ton of enemies in this monster... I'm just going to leave them alone. This monster closet, cage, whatever you want to call it. There's another serious speed power, but I don't want to waste that for some reason. I just don't. And there's a scrapjack again. This time I killed him pretty easily. Um, wasn't a big threat at all. Kamikaze's there. I must have Kamikaze bombed. And there's a Reptiloid. Easily killed that too with the Uzi. You see how powerful the Uzi is. You really need overpowered guns for what this game's gonna throw at you, so... I kind of shared that on Twitter, that I reversed rebalanced the game. It's a hilarious tweet. I kind of unbalanced the game on purpose to make it nuts later on. Like, enormous hordes of the toughest enemies. Like, completely unfairly difficult in some places. I kind of did that on purpose, because I wanted to make this, like, hell revealed. And here's our first Fiendian Reptiloid Demon, people! They're an enemy you should know from Serious Sam's second encounter. Let's see if we've cleared out this entire area first, before we leave. Just like doing that, Let's see if there's anything I'm missing. Apparently not. Cleared out everything. Now, there's probably secrets I'm missing, but it would take too long to find them all, and this is a let's play, and I have to do it in a certain amount of time, so... That level took less time than the uh, previous level, which is interesting. It usually takes me 10 to 12 minutes to beat a level in this game. So I'm done with these two levels, people, and I'll do two more tonight, and then we're going to do four tomorrow again, just like today, and we're going to get this thing finished by tomorrow night. So I hope you're ready for that.